How's everybody doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Exchange using Smart Technology Game. Now, I think before you start charging a price for a screen, you got to show the value of it. You got to show what makes your screen different from any other screen out there on the market. That's one of the things we demonstrated with that um, luminous uh, 4K black. That screen is different from any black screen out there on the market. You can take a sheet of tin metal or you can take any light screen and match it against that, try to put it against that screen and that black screen will produce a higher and brighter image than another black screen or a piece of sheet metal. That's what makes that technology different from any other black screen out there on the market. Now, I'm going to show you the difference in the technology behind the Illuminous. The Illuminous can produce, this is a silver luminous, can produce a white level so high that actually its color is brighter than the color white itself. Now keep in mind, silver screen can produce a higher white level than white. That's kind of mind boggling, isn't it? So I'm gonna show you what we have against our screen. And keep in mind, I'm gonna be looking for sample sheets of high performance projection screens to go side by side versus the luminous. I'm also going to be looking for screen paints, anything that can do a side by side demonstration to see, to prove how advanced this technology is. I'd love to be to get my hands on screen innovation, to tell you the truth. Anyway, so um, over here we have the Firehawk G4. We have the, um, this is a, uh, this is a Dark Star 9 with a 0 0.9. I'm also going to be doing the Great Cinema 5D. I had it here, I can't find it, so I'm going to have to order another one, Great Cinema 5D, to do some demonstrations on. We have Seymour AV, one of the, I think the best screen is here, the uh, Seymour AV 1.3. And of course over here we have a DMP Supernova, this is their blade we have here, okay? And then right here we have a white sheet of paper. Now. I have the white sheet of paper there to show you that we're going to do white levels and we're going to do contrast to show you that the screen, even though it is a high silver, it can produce uh, good contrast and white levels. And you see that white piece of paper right there? I'm going to turn that paper dark on a snow scene. Now the projector I'm using is 3200 lumens. It's a ViewSonic projector, no calibration, no 4K upscaling. Still set in the factory default settings from where the screen is sitting from here to here. We're about 11, about 10 to 11 feet away from the screen, fully lit environment. All right, so I'm gonna keep this fair. We're gonna do some of this demonstration with the lights off and the lights on. Now, first things first, let's remove. Boom! Oh, these screens are amazing. Now, I want you to look at that piece of paper. That is a white piece of paper. You notice that our screen is producing a higher white level than the white piece of paper. Everything else on the screen is dark. So let's start this so you can see it for yourself. Alright, now I'm going to come over here real quick, take my lights out, so we can get nice and dark in this one area right here. I'm going to hit the screen again. Look how dark, that's a white sheet of paper right there in the center of the screen, right there, that's a white piece of paper. All the other screens are going to turn dark. Now we're going to come out of here and we're going to grab, let me see, we'll get this video right here, we'll add some color in it. Now keep in mind, any bars you may see passing across the screen, that's due because the camera has complications picking up the images on the screen. Just like if you were to take a camera and you were to point it at a TV monitor, you would get the same reaction. Now, look at this right here. Now, our luminous technology can produce natural, pure color, perfect color balance, good contrast, fantastic and vivid colors without the screen becoming oversaturated with too much black, too much dark. Now we'll come back over here. Let's turn to the side. All right, you got some screens that'll blend. Of course that white piece of paper is gonna blend in nicely. Let's come over here. All right, come back over. Look at the white piece of paper in the middle. We'll pause it right there. Come back over here. We have our lights. It's on again. The lights keep dimming for some reason. We have automatic dimmers. All right, and we'll start. Lights are on.
And just to show you, even in a fully lit room, this panel is producing a higher gain, better color, better contrast, and a fully lit environment. And if you look at the white piece of paper, it's dark. So everything around it, that's where it gets the name luminous, because it's bright. Now keep in mind a DMP supernova would cost you four to five thousand dollars for a hundred inch. Dark Star 9 about two to three thousand, maybe a little less than that now because it's been out for a while. You're talking about a screen that we're going to be designing that is going to be four feet by eight feet. It's going to be flexible. It's going to allow you to curve it. It's going to be weatherproof. You can take it outside if you want. And the screen can operate on projectors as low as 50 lumens inside. We're talking about a price range around $16.22 for a 100 inch. And you could view these screens at a 190 degree angle. Let's grab another one. And we're going to do this on dark contrast, black levels. Like I said, for a screen to be that high silver, look at the con look at the uh, black levels. So it can maintain fantastic contrast, good black levels, and white levels at the same time with colors that explode off the screen. All right, before my time runs out here, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Thank you all for watching. I'm gonna be doing a lot more demonstrations on testing other sample sheets and screen paints against this technology. Even making some cheap screen paints from Home Depot.